앙냥이가 내가 찐다 오늘은 따란 따란 이거 이거 드립니다 오늘의 기차는 Everybody's welcome 이거 드릴게요 Cornelius was an officer in the Roman army He lived in a place called Caesarea He and his family respected God They weren't Jewish They were Gentiles Cornelius had a vision. An angel told him, God hears your prayers and knows that you help the poor. Send men to Joppa to bring Peter here. So Cornelius did. Cornelius and his family were not Jewish. They were Gentiles. Yeah. True or false? Oh, yeah, 정답이다. In Joppa the next day, Peter was on the roof praying. In a vision, a huge sheet came from heaven. It was filled with animals. A voice said, Kill something, Peter. Eat. What? They were animals that Jews weren't allowed to eat. I can't eat them, Peter replied. If I say they're all right to eat, the voice replied, then they're all right. <laughs> That's when Cornelius' messengers arrived. So Peter and some others went with them to Caesarea. Cornelius' house was filled with his friends and family, eager to hear Peter speak. God showed me, in a vision, that he accepts people from every nation. God sent Jesus to everyone. He is Lord of all. He healed the sick and freed the oppressed. He was crucified and then raised from the dead. Everyone who believes in him will be forgiven of their sins. The Holy Spirit came upon them, just like Pentecost. Peter baptized them. Did God show oh, and then raised from the dead? Everyone who believes in him will be forgiven of their sins. The Holy Spirit came upon them, just like Pentecost. Peter baptized them. Did God show Peter that he accepts all people from every nation? Yes. 정답. 어, 성상수를 받았고 이번에는 이거 읽어 드릴게요. 어허. 그래요. From enemy to friend.
Here got two. Oh, you lost that. Pound, poundy, pound, you lost that. You want to do this? You go. Oh, you can blow some more on. Oh, Saudi. Oh, how many we should have done that? Yes, we should have done that. Yes, we should have done that. Journeys for Jesus. Paul believed that God wanted him to tell Gentiles about Jesus. So he made three trips through Syria, Turkey, and Greece. Many people believed in Jesus, and many churches were started. Mm. <laughs> Years later, Paul returned to Jerusalem. Some people were upset by his teaching and attacked him. He was unfairly arrested. Since Paul was a Roman citizen, he asked for his trial to be in Rome. <laughs> A forever promise. John was a disciple of Jesus. One day, 
Jesus came to him in a vision, shining like the sun. Don't be afraid, said Jesus. I died. Now I live forever. Then John saw a new heaven and a new earth, God's promised new creation. The first heaven and the first earth were gone, and the sea with them. Next, John saw God's holy city, the new Jerusalem. It was coming down from heaven. It was beautiful, like a bride on her wedding day, ready to meet her husband. voice coming from the throne of God, saying, From now on, God will make his home among his people, and they will all live together. In this new heaven and new earth, there won't be any tears, because no one will be in pain, and no one will die. Those things are gone forever. I am the beginning and the end. If you are thirsty, come to me, and I will give you the water of life. My new world is for my children, those who are faithful to me. I'm making all things new. It's true. You can count on it. <laughs> the new world will be for those who believe in Jesus and are faithful to him. True or false? 정답. 오 손상수요. 봤고요. 오늘은 맨 마지막. God's good news. 이거 드립니다. In the beginning, God made everything. He made it perfect. He made us too in His image. He loves us and wants to have a relationship with us. Sadly, Adam and Eve disobeyed God. That sin brought death into the world and broke our relationship with God. It also broke God's perfect world. <gasps> sin spread throughout the whole world. Everyone sins, and the result of sin is death. But sin couldn't stop God from loving us. He had a plan. <laughs> because of his love for us, God sent his son, Jesus, into the world. Sin broke our relationship with God. But Jesus came to fix it. Jesus healed sick people and performed many other miracles. He welcomed lonely people. He taught people about God's love. His perfect life shows us what love looks like. Even though Jesus never sinned, he died on a cross for our sins because he loves us. By doing this, he was carrying out God's plan to fix our relationship with him. Oh. Three days later, Jesus rose from the dead, 
breaking the power of sin and death. He spent time with his followers, teaching them. Then he returned to heaven. Now Jesus lives forever. Jesus did not leave us alone. He sent his Holy Spirit to live inside everyone who trusts him. The Spirit gives us power to live the way God created us to live. <laughs> One day, when Jesus returns, God will make everything perfect again. He will make a new heaven and a new earth. Everyone who trusts in Jesus will live with him forever. <laughs> God loves you. He created you one of a kind. Trusting and following Jesus fixes our broken relationship with God. Are you ready to be a part of God's story? Bye-bye.